five, four, three, two, one. Good afternoon, this is Skills USA News. I'm Sophie Martin. And I'm Benjamin Cohen. Coming up, robots in the workplace and how technology is enhancing your golf game. But first, Sophia, tell us about how Skills USA is training our future leaders. Skills USA California is part of an organization that works to enhance career and technical education in the classroom, as well as to provide leadership training for youth so they become our business and industry leaders of tomorrow. Today, Skills USA is holding the state competition where teams compete in specialties like broadcast news production. This has helped keep the industry alive as technological alternatives to receiving news has led people to stray from traditional TV news. The advent of technology leads to the dark question of whether technology is taking over our lives. But with the increase of students taking courses in the broadcast field, there is hope that the future of broadcast will take place in the hands of the upcoming generations. You know, Sophia, with wire services and quick headlines, it sounds like the technological advances have become beneficial to providing news to people on the go. Benjamin, that's a great point. Having stories released quickly are a plus, but it's one thing to read a headline and another to view a broadcaster that provides context so the viewer at home understands the importance. We as broadcasters bring an element of understanding for the viewers and make the news more human and relatable. Now to you, Benjamin, with National News. Thanks, Sophia. Almost half of those currently employed in the United States are at risk of being put out of work by automation in the next decade. Machines are no longer assisting human labor, but are rather redefining American employment. Therefore, the demand for human workers has diminished and just worse off than before. Despite the alarming intrusion of present-day software, uh, human labor will always be a necessity due to the ever-transforming nature of current trends and human capabilities. That's right, we aren't going anywhere. And let's not forget who invented robotics and artificial intelligence in the first place. Now, see you, Sophia, with news on the future of sports. Thanks, Benjamin. CBS Sports is creating an exciting future for sports broadcasting through tech. Ken Agar, the mastermind behind tech for marketing sports broadcasts, has shifted his focus onto the viewer's experience. In order to keep viewers in their seats, he has brought the innovative swing and pro tracer technologies to golf. Agar keeps the changing future of tech advances in mind to entice viewers so that sporting events remain meaningful for those watching. Next time you watch CBS Sports, thank Ken Agar for his hole-in-one method of tech-based entertainment. Let's hear from Benjamin on the new way that we're in the national industry. Thanks, Sophia. Before worrying about the technology takeover of today's booming industries, take a look at Mercedes-Benz and its decision to swap some of its manufacturing robots for more capable humans. This German-designed car company produces 400,000 vehicles a year per manufacturing plant all over the world. The robots simply cannot keep up with the complexity of modern and customized designs. But Mercedes-Benz has turned to humans for their precision in order to ensure their consumers a true luxury vehicle. After all, there's nothing better than a human touch. That's all for now. I'm Sophie, I'm Benjamin Cohen. And I'm Sophie Martin. And this is Skills USA, USA News. News. Oh my That's a wrap. <laughs> all right, congratulations. Yeah.